As you know, uh, things are evolving quite uh, quickly, and that's why we are uh, arranging a series of uh, briefings and updates and to provide regular uh, press releases to keep uh, the media as well as uh, Singaporeans informed of the development of the situation. And today, uh, six more cases of uh, COVID-19 have been discharged. COVID-19 is now the official name of the uh, virus, have been discharged from hospital uh, in all, 15 patients have fully recovered from this infection and have been discharged. Uh, we are happy for them and uh, their families. There are three new more cases uh, today, and uh, uh, my DMS, uh, uh, Professor Kenneth Mark, will provide more details of these cases shortly. And of the 35 confirmed cases who are still in hospital, including these three new cases, most are stable or improving. But it are in critical condition in the intensive care unit. We continue to keep them in our thoughts and our staff, our hospital workers, will continue to provide them uh, the best care possible. While most infected patients uh, will recover, some may, get, may become uh, seriously ill and a small number may succumb to the inf infection uh, ultimately. We have to be prepared for the worst. I understand that the Singaporeans are concerned and many are anxious. Some are even wary of our healthcare workers and shun our nurses, doctors, and healthcare professionals. I would like to take this opportunity to appeal to Singaporeans not to do so. In fact, let's come together to show our support for them and to support their work so that they continue to take care of our patients and our families and our loved ones. Minister Desmond Lee will share more of the initiatives uh, in this direction uh, later on. And would encourage Singaporeans to rally around our healthcare workers in particular, show them the well-deserved support they need. Sometimes a kind word or a warm greeting will go a long way to make them feel appreciated and gives them a morale boost to continue their efforts. I want to take this opportunity to thank all our, our healthcare workers uh, who are at the front line caring for our, uh, uh, our patients and our loved ones. In particular, I would like to thank our general practitioners, our private uh, GP doctors, who are our frontline partners. They play a critical role in uh, detecting and managing our patients, and they are our important partners at the front line. We will continue to support our private doctors, uh, including uh, uh, specialists. Uh, some of them have fed back that they are concerned about the supply of masks as they need the masks to allow them to continue to look after our patients. I would like to take this opportunity to assure them that uh, they will get the supplies they need because they are part of our team. Uh, we will put in place all the necessary supplies to ensure that they, they can continue to take care of our patients. In fact, we will put aside one million masks for distribution to them and uh, to show them uh, that we want them to be part of our team. And more details will be shared with them uh, shortly. Uh, in this challenging time, it is important for us to work together as a team, as a community, and as a nation to overcome this infection and to keep Singaporeans safe.